Our first new move of the day is stamp. All right. Now in tap dancing, to do a stamp, pick up your foot, put the entire foot down flat all at once, nice and loud. That's a stamp. Make sure the toe and heel taps hit at the same time like this. If your toe hits first, that's bad. If your heel hits first, also bad. If they hit at the same time, you're doing right. Good. So when you do a stamp, not only do you do it flat foot, but you put your weight on that leg. And that's important to know because if your weight is on your right leg and you have to use your left, <laughs> if your weight is on your right leg, essentially your left foot is free to go next. So that kind of tells us we're going to be changing feet. So left side stamp, I pick up the foot, put it down flat. Right foot, pick it up, and left foot. You know, you've heard someone say, you know, stamp your feet. This is it. These are stamps. Not too hard. Let's go faster. Now, don't put it down so hard that it hurts your leg or your knees or your back, right? Just, just put it down hard enough to get a good, loud sound. Right now, I'm just keeping a nice, even rhythm. One, two, three, four, and five, six, and a move to the right, y'all. One, two, three, four, five, six, moving back to the left now. One, two, three, four, a five, and a six, and you got the idea. These are stamps. These are stamps. Flat foot, nice and loud. I think you got the idea, all right? Well, there's another move that's related to a stamp the same way a touch is related to a step. And that move is stomp. Now, like, it all sounds like mumbo jumbo to me. A stomp is almost like a stamp. It's flat foot, but no weight. You can think of it as a flat foot touch, right? So stomp is flat foot, no weight. Stomp. Again, make sure that foot hits flat with no weight. Nice loud sound, don't hit it too hard. You don't want to hurt yourself. Stomp, and stomp, and stomp, and stomp. Now, in a lot of cases, you'll bring it up immediately like this. Up, up. In some cases, it'll stay down for a little bit. Down, up, down, up. As long as my weight's not on it, either one of those is totally fine. Okay? So just don't put your weight on it, and then it doesn't matter. These are stomps. Let's go faster. Right? I want to clap my hands when your partner does see go. You got the idea. <laughs> it's like a hoedown, right? Hoedown, showdown. Very good. Let's try the left foot. Stomps. Here we go. Six. Ready. And stomp. And stomp. And stomp. If you're having trouble keeping your balance, tighten your stomach muscles up a little bit and stare at one point straight ahead on the wall. Faster. Stomp and stomp and stomp and stomp. Stomp and stomp and stomp and stomp. And a nice even rhythm, just like this. Hey! Good, so you know stamps, flat foot with weight. Stamp, 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 stamp. And you know stomps, flat foot, no weight. Wait. That's like the do si do, right? Another easy way to remember it, when you put a stamp on an envelope, it stays down on the envelope. When you put a stamp down on the floor, it stays down so the other foot is free. Stamp it down, leave it down. 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 Stomps come right back up. All right, so that's stamp and stomp. They're kind of related, just like step and touch.